Oh my god, this better change colors. Oh my god, look at like <gasps> Oh my god, I cannot believe this is the darkest shade. Oh my god, this can't be right. <gasps> Scooch! Fucking wow. On a bucket list, I flex so effortless. Fucking possible, I'm falling off that don't exist. I went rapping, I be selling our god, it's just to pay the rent. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Allegra Lil Ray. I probably should just stop saying that. Like, I really don't think I need to say that in every video. But yeah, today we're going to do a first impressions video as well as a discussion about Riverdale Season 2, Episode 2. Um, I just think it's easier to talk about, like, something like a TV show while I do this than something at random. I feel like I would just ramble and lose my place and probably forget I'm talking. So yeah, let's get started. With this black... Radiance True Complexion Shine Control Primer. And I did a whole of these products that I'm using, so if I miss something, you can always go back to that video and check it out. Oh, okay, this is interesting. So I don't know what to put on first. I'm gonna I wanna I'm just gonna put this on by itself because it's the first impressions. I'm not going to add anything with it, and I'm going to see how it does on its own. Ooh. Wow. That feels nice. It's like lotion. It's even smoother with, smoother than the Wet n Wild. I don't know if it's me, but the Wet n Wild kind of feels a bit grainy. Or is that me? Is that me, or does it feel grainy? Let me know. Mm hmm It says Shine Control Primer. Can you see it? Shine Control Primer. I feel like I'm looking shiny. If I look shiny, I'm going to be mad. But yeah, I really like this episode. A lot of stuff happened. I really think it d did a good job of focusing on character development of all of the characters and they have a lot of characters to work with but I definitely feel like they did a good job when it came to the character development of everybody even the side characters why does my dog have to be in every video here are you happy are you happy now can I get a kiss thank you okay Go get in your bed, please. Go get in the bed. I keep dropping the mic. Just because I feel like it throws off the dimension when I do it last. Especially now when I'm trying to work with adding powders and stuff. And I'm definitely going to put this on my eyelids as well. Can you hear me? I'm definitely going to put this on my eyelids as well. I honestly, honestly hope you can. Okay, so when Riverdale opened up with the pops thing, I missed the de the diner, death diner part, and I only caught when he said, "Look at what they wrote on my on my wall or on my store or whatever," and I was like, "Are they gonna go there?" I was like, "Are they really gonna go there? Are they gonna take it there? Are they really gonna take it there?" Because you know, pops is black, so. I thought they put the n-word. I thought they put the n-word. So I was like, oh shit, I can't believe they're really gonna go there. But no, they didn't. I, re I had to rewind it. Because I, I really, I'm glad I did. Because I couldn't believe it. I was like, what? What is going on? This is crazy. They are definitely not going there. Not on the CW. Mm -mm, the CW is not going for that. But yeah, I said diner death. Or this is gonna lead into like the Veronica Jughead contrast that they have going but I feel bad for Veronica because she wants to believe in her parents <sighs> it's a lot of people I want to believe in you guys can you tell like she wants to believe in her parents but her parents just aren't good people 
they just aren't and you can tell that they're lying and manipulating her because they love her and they don't want her to see them in a bad way because I feel like she wants to be in the position that Jughead is in like Jughead I feel like he's going down a slippery slope and it's nobody's fault sometimes that's just how life is you get put into environments that just aren't the best for you and you can't get out of them I like the the contrast between uh, Veronica and Jughead because they're showing how they're both in similar situations but their parents are completely different people one parent wants to do good they want to do good things but they keep getting put in bad situations without without a good way out but Veronica's parents they want to do bad things they aren't good people. I feel like Jughead's dad is a genuinely good person in a bad situation. And Veronica's parents are... I don't, want, I don't want to say genuinely bad, but not good people. And they are putting themselves... They're intentionally, intentionally putting themselves in that situation. Okay, so... I'm going to try this Wet n Wild on one side. And then I'm going to try this BH Cosmetic on the other side. And the Wet n Wild is in the color Mocha. And the BH Cosmetic color is in the color Mocha 225. But they both look so different. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Look at how this one looks. And look at how this one looks. I'm nervous. The primer looked like it dried down pretty decent. I'm nervous I'm nervous I'm doing it in the mirror because I don't want to miss anything like I can't see doing my makeup in the camera I need something like this close to my face so it comes in a stick like this and I forgot what this is like a dupe of but it comes in a stick like this which I guess is pretty easy to ooh 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 I'm gonna have to put my glasses on oh my gosh that looks really dark. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Am I putting too much on? Yeah. Peabody. Oh yeah, and I'm going to try these BH Cosmetic brushes. I'm going to try this round blending brush on this side. And then I'm going to try the flat blending brush on the other side to see if I like a difference because I don't I don't really like this too much for blending and I want to try brushes so let's go oh my god that looks dark as hell is it me should I just tap it in oh god oh hell no oh hell no oh my gosh is it me is it I'm gonna have to put my glasses on after this Oh god, am I going to be disappointed? Oh my gosh. And I think, is this supposed to be mattifying? I don't know if this is mattifying. I thought this was mattifying. Oh my god, I have oily skin. I can't use, I have oily skin. I can't use. Okay, I'm going to get closer. Like, it's winter. T it's getting colder out, so... And I don't normally put stuff on my neck, but with this, I feel like I have to put it on my neck. I like this brush, though. How does it look to you guys? Do you guys like this brush? I like it. But, oh my gosh, what the heck, though? Okay, jug Jughead me meeting Penny Peabody. I was like, ooh, Jughead, don't do it don't do it because the moment she asked for a favor I was like that's it you're trapped you're gonna have to leave town you're gonna have to leave town because people like that and his dad tried to warn him people like that just even if you guys are in the same boat don't always have good intentions okay I'm gonna put my um, glasses on so I just think it's crazy how Mm, it's a little orange it it definitely has an orange undertone to it so I would definitely mix this with something I don't know if I would use this by itself right now because it's the summertime I mean unless it's the summertime 
But yeah, that mm, I I like it. It's just a little on the orange side. I'm used to stuff having a yellow undertone. But I knew that wouldn't be too bad. It's this I'm worried about. It is. Let me put it on my hand. I think you're supposed to shake some stuff up first. Okay, that's how it looks. Wow, that looks so light. And this is the color Mocha. I hope this oxidizes. So I'm just going to take this. Oh. oh, I can't believe I spent my money on this. Oh my god, this better change colors. Oh my god, look at that. Oh my god, I cannot believe this is the darkest shade. Oh my god, this can't be right. I mean, this isn't the darkest shade, but does that look like this to you? Does that look like this? It does not look like this to me. Okay, that looks, oh my gosh, these don't even look this experience before I don't even know what to do oh my god Let me see. Let me see. Can this be fixed? Let me go. I'm going to go wet this beauty blender. And I'm going to see. Maybe I just put too much on. Maybe I just put too much on. Okay. Is that looking better? Okay, that's definitely looking better. But you can tell how one side is dark and one side is light. They both blend, but one is darker than the other. I feel like I would definitely have to mix this with something else. Yeah, it says medium to full coverage. Oh my god. Let me... I for completely forget what I was talking about. The penny... Any Peabody thing? Oh my god. This had me shook and not in a good way. Okay. Can you guys see that? That looks a lot better. I'm gonna add a little bit. That looks a lot better. I guess you definitely don't warning. Do not use a lot of this because it will scare you like it scared me because I could put some on my neck even though I don't normally do that wow Oof, I got scared for a minute I definitely got scared for a minute so I can definitely see myself mixing these two together to get a better shade for me because this is too dark, this is too light, but I feel like together they would make a good combination. I definitely like this, the round blending brush, way better than the flat one. The flat one... I think I just put too much foundation on it. I guess they both, but I do like this one a little bit better. I feel like this is for a light coverage foundation. This one is definitely for light coverage, and this one is for heavier. 
after I covered. Okay, so the meeting between Jughead and Shiro I thought was so random how like everybody reacted like nobody did anything wrong on their on their side of the family. Like nobody's innocent on Shiro's side at all. After letting this sit for a while, I like I like it. But yeah, nobody's innocent on Cheryl's side of the family and I don't think they should be making people like feel like they're the ones who were the victims. Yeah, they were the victims, but your mom's just just as guilty if anybody because she knew everything your dad was doing. She didn't tell you guys, which I can understand, but she didn't protect you guys either. <sighs> So I have these, these are actually I guess face contouring brushes, but I'm going to use them for the eyes because look at this, they just look like they would be great for the eyes, don't you think? I don't know about this one, but these would be great for the eyes. And I also have this kit they sent me for the eyes, which I want to try. I don't know what this is. I'm guessing this is a blending brush. I want to try this one. It's look great for traveling. You know, Cheryl gets on my nerves. Like I like Cheryl. Like she's a like I feel like Cheryl's a good person that has to do like the hard things that nobody else can do. But she doesn't have to go about it the mean way, you know? Which brings us to Betty. Betty Badass, as I like to call her. Betty, she's an interesting allegory, okay? That's what I wrote down. Interesting allegory. Because I feel like she's just like Cheryl. She's just nicer about it. Am I the only one that thinks Betty's just like Cheryl? She's just more likable? Okay. So I'm going to take this color right here. I don't know what I'm doing, just to let you guys know. I was torn between this color, this color, and this color right here but I decided to go with this that should, this looks so pink on camera it's not it's like a neutral peach color like a peachy brown color but it's coming up very pink on camera so it's scaring me how these colors might translate once I put them on so it's making me feel like I should get this color instead okay let me try this color instead So here's hoping they show up. Are they pigmented or are they not? Whoa! Whoa! Very pigmented. Okay. Wow. Okay, yeah, that is whoa. Oh my gosh, that's so pigmented. I was not expecting that. Oh my gosh, that shocked me. I was, yeah, you do not, this, this is not for the faint of heart. You do not need a lot of this. And this doesn't even look like it comes off, did I, it comes off purple. Well, I guess it does in here, but on here it's more like, in person it's more of a brown color. So maybe I should take a picture of this and that'll show me the true colors. But yeah, wow. <laughs> was not expecting that at all put that in my crease and try to bring it down some and I'm trying not to go heavy-handed I really need to be looking in the mirror to be honest but I'm not okay so I'm gonna take this brush and I want to put it like all in on my eye and see how it looks so I was torn between this orange and this peach, but I'm really feeling peachy looks right now. I feel like the peach would look well with this purplish color, so I'm going to try that. Ooh. Interesting. Very interesting. I don't know if I'm seeing peach. What else is that saying? Okay, so Betty's mom, like, I feel like Betty, Cheryl, and Betty's mom all have the same, like, complexity to them. Like, Betty's mom is mean, but it's like she's not really mean. 
it's just like she just tells the truth but she's mean about it sometimes she's mean i'm not gonna lie they put her off as like the strict overbearing parent in the beginning but then like after she became like this nice nice sweet person i don't like that shade that's more of like a trend uh that was more of a, a transitional shade hmm that's interesting See? oh yeah that was kind of unrealistic to me about how they found out what happened to miss grundy like i feel like in reality it would be like a news article on facebook right and then somebody would read and be like oh i know that teacher she went here and then like it would spread and then the principals would be like okay i want to talk about this before it gets out of control yes miss grundy was murdered do we have any information on her no nobody has any information what are the cops doing i'm tired of the cops being in this tv show just take them out and let jughead and betty solve everything like just get rid of the cops please because they're not doing anything <gasps> it's the cops I don't know I just know that sheriff is not doing a goddamn thing and neither am I with this makeup look <clears throat> I feel like I could fix it let's see mm, I'm gonna take this angle brush cause I wanna try to see like if I can do something like that with it but with a darker color but like I don't know what darker color I should use like I use this as a transition color so I'm thinking I should take a brown and this purple a brown and purple and mix it and put it in my crease and see how it does the transition color. Mm, I don't know if I like it. What do you guys think? It looks like it's just blending in. It's not really doing anything. Let me put my glasses on. Mm, I guess it did a little something. It's not giving me that pop that I would like. trying to see what color I want to use like what just not seeing the the vibrant dimensions that I, I want so they have a darker shade that I'm gonna take but I don't really like putting darker shades on my eyes because I just don't think it looks right Maybe it's, it's just isn't a... Oh. Should I try this one? But yeah, the character development in this show is good, but... Like, it just has some... I feel like Veronica's definitely going to find out her parents are lying to her. Definitely. Definitely, definitely. She's going to have to. I feel like I should stop. Let me listen to my intuition. And stop right now. And go on the other side. The only thing about looking into a camera is, especially if you wear glasses like I do, you can't see. You can't see anything. Now I know some people like 
can soften this up, but I don't know. I don't know if I'll be able to do that. I'm not a pro. I don't even know if you'll be able to hear me in this, and I might have to do this whole thing all over again. So before I fix that up, I'm going to take this flat brush and, fuck, the spray is all the way up there. I definitely felt like the, um, the dinner and the party was a good way. I'm spraying this with this Mario Badescu. Oh no, don't do drugs. I'm just saying. I'm just thinking of, like, from his perspective, not what you should do in real life. What he should have did was really get help, but it looked like he tried to get help, but they had, like, this jock-like character embarrassing him about everything, so it kind of messed it up. All right, I'm going to take this color right here. It's like a gold color, but I'm nervous because I don't like these other light shimmery colors that they have. I feel like that's too light for me, so I'm going to take this gold color and see what it do. I'm gonna see what it do. I'm nervous it's not gonna be shimmery enough. Okay, I guess. It's really not packing on like I would like for it to. I guess it is, or is it me, or can I just not see? Oh, there we go. I'm going to dip back into what I used as that transitional shade. I'm just going to try to blend around that. And now I'm just going to do the same for here, just to soften it up. Did it soften it up? What do you guys think? One side is always different from the other, isn't it? But yeah, I definitely was surprised at the ending. But who did he kill this time? Like, who did he kill? Who did he kill? And where's Polly? Where the heck is Polly? Am I the only one that wants to know where Polly is? Excuse my hair. I'm just I'm just trying to make it. We're out here trying to make it until next week. We're out here trying to make it. Curly haired people know. What? Go get in the bed. Go. Okay, so this is how the makeup looks. Uh, it's not that. Oh, look at this line in my. Is this? Look at this line in my forehead. Oh gosh, that did not help. Yeah, this is the makeup. Mm, yeah, I like it. It's like makeup. It dried down pretty nice. The color had me shook though. Like, you can still see a bit of a difference with the colors. Like, this side still looks a little bit lighter than this side, but yeah. Okay, I forgot my, um, mascara. That fucking sucks. So, I am gonna try this flower eyeliner see how I like it I hope you can hear me like I don't feel like yelling into the mic mm, that was pretty dark
Does that look weird? <laughs> this goes on easy in the upper eyelid too. Okay, what now? Oh yeah, the deathly ending, the last part. Sorry this one was so bad guys, I just, I guess I wasn't prepared as much as I thought. I'm gonna take this contour shade, there's a black radiance again. And they have like this sculpt stuff. I just wanna put it a little bit under my eyes. Just to brighten up that under eye area. I feel like it's red. Does it look red? I see a difference. Okay. I like it. Let me get around. It's very good for detailing. For uh, those of you who are detail oriented. Oh, it didn't blend out all the way right here. Or did I do that? Mm, let me try to wet this. <sighs> yeah, I'm definitely not working out. Hell no. I'm tired. So I'm going to take this bronzer. Oh no, this is a contour. I'm going to use it as a bronzer. And just add it to my face. If everything is subtle though. I definitely don't mind that bronze look. And this it's a blushed palette as well so I don't like this crease in my forehead so what I'm gonna do is I don't know what shade I want to use let's see let's look this looks it looks nice on camera Me and blush have a very shady relationship. I guess you can see it. You tell me. The thing with blush is, it like my, it needs the heat of my body, you know, or else you can't see it. You can never see blush right away on my skin. My eyebrows look weird. Man. Okay. I see. I feel like see. I feel like you're starting to see it. It's very natural. I don't have lights everywhere, so but I feel like you're starting to be able to see it. And normally, when I put on like a liquid lipstick, I make sure I have like some Vaseline on my lips or something, but I don't. So I'm just gonna put it on there, so let's pray to God. Or whoever you want to, that it goes okay. Because I'm gonna be mad if I have to shoot this shit all over again. It has like a little dip on the inside. This is the Wet n Wild. And the color, I don't know. Don't know. Give me mocha. I guess mocha is just for me. Okay. That's pink as hell. I guess, oh, I can see that drying down to a nice matte color. Okay, I like that a lot better. Yeah, I like that a lot better. Mmm, 
that's cute. Got dried down. Very pretty. Yes, I would definitely wear this. Maybe with some gel in my head. I don't know. Yeah, look at this brown. Very harsh. Yeah, I hope all this sets well. But yeah, I probably should have put this on first. Let me find some mascara so I can get off. Fucking tired. Highlighter. So I have this highlighter in... Crown of My Canopy. And I'm going to use this that they gave me. This is a BH. All my brushes that I use today, besides like two, are BH cosmetic brushes. Alright, I'm going to start up here. Can you see it? Oh yeah, you can see it. You can see it. There we go. Everywhere, but only I need a new one because this one's getting very clumpy. 